Vacuum desalination, a low-tech, highly reliable method of creating fresh water. The following movie illustrates a test unit which is comprised of a six-foot diameter concrete tube that rises 50 feet above sea level at high tide in a nearshore installation. This cutaway view shows the sea floor, the ocean, the base of the tower, and the pier on which equipment is mounted. The ocean here is 15 to 20 feet deep. The base of the tower is buried in the sea floor. At the bottom of the tube are seawater inlet holes. Also on the base is the freshwater collection tank. The components at the top of the tube include a platform, a refrigeration compressor, and on the inside of the tube, a conical stainless steel condensation surface. As a vacuum is pulled on the space above the seawater, the boiling point of that seawater drops. The seawater cannot rise higher than 33 feet under vacuum, so with a 50-foot tower, an evacuated space is created above the seawater. The seawater can then be boiled at less than 100 degrees Fahrenheit. The heaters will be immersed at 32 and a half feet. Once the seawater boils, the fresh water vapor can be condensed on the conical surface and the condensate then runs down the vacuum tube. As the fresh water collects in the tank mounted on the base of the tower, it is pumped out with a shore mounted pump. Once a vacuum is pulled in the top of the tube, there is no way for the vacuum to be broken, and when the tide goes out, the vacuum gets even more complete. This means that these units will be very inexpensive to operate, also it has no internal moving parts. The concept can also be scaled up, of course. Vacuum desalination. 
a low-tech, highly reliable method of creating fresh water.